Uh, hello and welcome to my DIY today and today I'm going to show you my um, air fryer that I got and some of the things I'm going to cook in it and I just love it and let's show you I'm going to show you different days that I've been using it let's get started here's the instant fryer and it's the same uh, I mean it's it kind of reminds me of the instant pot but it's got all these trays in it. It's got, you could put something on there, something on here, and then this is the drip tray. You can even line that with aluminum foil if you wanted. And it also has this rotating tray that you could put your fries in. I'll show you that. I just put the lid on it, and then you, it has some little slots that you put the air fryer in. And then that rotates it. And you can put, oh, okay, air, let's see, whoops, I want to rotate. Let's do air fry, rotate, start, and there it going. It's got the light on in there. And that's how you do your fries. Some of them have trays that you pull out and you have to shake the tray, but this one keeps them moving. I'll do some fries in those uh, probably tomorrow. Okay, let's go ahead and, oh, this is your time of how long you want it to be going. And this is the temperature of how much you want it. And this is cancel. And you gotta remember, when you're cooking in this, it's hot. It's not like the microwave. And I uh, have these little things to grab with. And this is the chicken roaster. And it's got these spears on the end. And you have to attach these. And you put those, uh, there's a screw right here. You unscrew it. And then you slip this through here. And then put that screw on. Then you insert that side, and then this side, and you put your chicken on there. And I guess I could put a hot dog on there. I don't have a chicken. Okay, you push, oh, air fry, rotate, start, and light. Then you can see that moving. Let's do a cancel. Hey, the sausages or sausage patties are on there. Close her up. Air fry. Start. Let's see what the temperature is 400 for 18 minutes. Okay. Be back in 18 minutes. Oh, it's cooking good. Seven more minutes. I like them done really well. You don't even have to turn them over. Okay, and they are done. Mm. Those look perfect. Okay, that's how I like them. The trip in the tray there. Okay, let's eat them up. Yeah, the kids want sausages and tots, tater tots. So let's cook them both in there and see if that'll work. Um, if I need more space, I think I'll put these up here. Good question. Looks like it's doing good. Okay, the tots, sausages, both done. I think it's about 20 minutes. Easy cheesy. Now I'm going to put uh, these fryers. I had these in the freezer, so I might as well just use these up. Put them in there. Preheat the oven. Let's see. Preheat. Start to 300 and 300 degrees. It says. Okay. Whoops. Wait. Do these fries and see how they do. 
They look done. Oops, I forgot to put the drip tray under. All right, let's get those out. There they are, mighty hot too. Let's test them. Mm, crispy on the outside, soft in the middle. Success. I want tater tots. I saw these in the freezer. So I'm going to use my instant fryer. Haven't had a chance to try that out yet. There's only that many. We don't want to heat a whole oven up for that. Let's see. Air fry. Start. Two. Let's see. Let's turn light on so we can see what's going on in there. It's supposed to spin. Oh, let's do rotate. There it goes. What the? Okay, there they go. Is that just floating? There we go. <laughs> now we are baking some cookies. It says it has seven minutes left, but they look done. Maybe they cook faster in here. <laughs> Let's let them cool off. Ow, because that is... Okay, not, do not grab that with a bare hand. That is hot. See, you're thinking microwave. I am anyway. Hmm, they look good. Let them cool off. We got Joanna. Making, what are these called again? Bagel balls. Bagel balls. We want to try out this air fryer. And they look, actually look really good. Pull them out in a minute here. How long do you cook them for? It was 11 minutes. And you set a timer? Let's take a look at them. Oh, wow. Whoops. I don't know if they're done on the inside. Oh, yeah, that's the see. part that's hard to tell. I hope you liked the DIY on the air fryer and um, I really like it because it's instant. I don't have to heat up the stove. I don't have to heat up the oven. I can just pop it in there one or two, three things and it's done. It's good to go. So that's what I like about instant fryer and thanks for liking, commenting and subscribing and remember to watch for my DIYs every Friday at 2. Thank you and goodbye.